So Wilding is a book about a rewilding project that's run by my husband and I in Sussex where we live on land that was intensively farmed, so, so very intensive arable and dairy farming. And in about the 1990s, the farming business hit a buffer. We realised we couldn't go on. And we decided to do something with the land rather than working against it all the time. And we decided to do something that was quite con controversial and people thought we were crazy to do it. But we turned the whole area, the whole three and a half thousand acres, over to nature. And we didn't do that in a way that conservation normally does, which is kind of locking down a habitat and keeping it in stasis, as it were, for certain creatures to protect them or to, you know, to become a kind of Noah's Ark. We just let nature take over. We, let, we took our hands off the steering wheel and let nature take over the driving seat. Um, so apart from adding free-roaming animals into the project, which are drivers of a system, they kind of bring the dynamism to a landscape that's been very plateaued for a while. Apart from doing that, we really have just let nature go. And the result has been absolutely astonishing. So we now have some of the most endangered species in Britain. And remember, this is in the most populated, densely populated part of Britain. So underneath the Gatwick stacking system, surrounded by, by dual carriageways. And we have suddenly become a haven for things like nightingales, turtle doves, purple emperors. Um, and across the board, the whole gamut of wildlife is just taking off. So we've become a bit of a cool celeb, I mean, taken us completely by surprise, but now we're visited by NGOs, by the National Trust, the RSPB, even government, government ministers this year, really trying to look at how it's working. How is rewilding being so successful where everywhere else conservation measures are manifestly failing? Um, and the key really is this letting go of nature. So. I think the book is, is not only a, a positive story, it's a good, good it's, it's full of hope, it's full of, full of you know, positive um, ideas for how to bring nature back, that nature can come back you know, at the drop of a hat if you just let it. It's really a question of how can we, we're a nation of control freaks, and how can we learn to live with messy, chaotic, um, unpredictable nature? Uh, it's really a question of can we learn to rewild ourselves?